Hello from Bryson City. It is time for another free art lesson. Today we are doing kawaii doodles. Uh, for those who don't know what kawaii is, it is the music for cute students. Um, it's something that's developed in their culture over centuries. Um, there is an awesome, if you ever get a chance to go to Epcot, uh, there is an awesome uh, Kauai Museum there at Epcot. You can also Google Kauai and see the plethora, enormous amounts of cute little creatures and things that they have. Um, that some of you are very, probably very familiar with, didn't even realize that um, Hello Kitty is Kauai, and it's actually not Hello Kitty. It is Kitty White. Dun, dun, dun. Who knew? So, um, there's also, I mean, a plethora of other creatures and, and collections. I know there's a there's a, another cat. And, uh-oh, Betsy's here. What what other... Ah. <laughs> That's right. Gumatana. Um... So, a lot of different things. So, we're going to work on today just drawing some basic characters. Um, we're going to work on drawing um, probably two or three characters and drawing those characters in um, different poses to kind of round them out, flesh them out. Um, the beginnings, I guess, of what you'd call um, serial art or making, uh, making a comic book. Or um, comic strip. So, let's flip it around here and get ready to get started. All right. So, let's pick the camera. And we got the same different ones. So, for um, for the first um. For the first one, I'm going to draw basically the same thing I did when we did the doodles last time. I'm going to start with a circle. Here's my circle. He's going to have a little eyes. So I'm going to draw his eyes. Be right here. Let's see. Like that, and here's his mouth. What Done. Okay. Mm -hmm. Now, on the other one too, I also drew a little top, a little hair up here, and he had some shoes. I don't think he's gonna have any hands. So I think that's going to be the thing that um, we'll figure that out. Um, second character. I like the cat, so I think we're going to go with the cat. So the cat, when you see him, he's kind of a... He has his eyes and his mouth. Or his, actually, we're not going to do a mouth. We're just going to do a cat nose. So do his eyes and just his nose. And then for the rest of the cat, we're going to draw him in this shape. So we am going to put a line here. And his two paw, front paws here. Back paws there. There we go. Back. This one's weird. <laughs> this is the one that I saw at Epcot, but it's not this. It doesn't look like this. And finish him off. Here's his tail. To the llama. The the llama one. The llama, yeah. Guma llama. I don't remember. Guma Let's say our cat has some stripes too. So just a couple of ziggy lines here. 
his mouth, his nose. I remember that. Right here. There we go. Angry. Boom. At <laughs> angry. It's angry. It's angry that those people have. Can you draw one with like this with just the simple eyes? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I had the best idea. What if I draw the Chinese unicorn? Or dragon? Yeah, whatever you want to do. Big brain. Put some stripes on that tail. Just like that. So I can, I can, um, I'll come in this way. Let's say he's walking. So the good thing is because he's a circle, pretty simple. Let's say he's walking um, this way. So his hair, his little tuft of hair, we'll have that go that way. All right, so if you notice, let me let me zoom in on him here. I put a shoe here. And this one's because he's running. So then you can also do this. Just a couple lines to show some motion. Just imagine the eyes were colored in, but he's cute. And another one, let's say he's rolled over, rolled over on his, on his back. So he's like this, a little bit of the hair here. Put a shoe here and a shoe here. And you're seeing the bottom of his shoes now. So I'm going to fill him in this way and go like this. Again, so just developing out the character. Here's that hair again. Eyes. There's his mouth. He looks surprised at you. <laughs> All right. Why don't you try drawing this cat, Betsy? Oh, okay. So what start with the triangle. I know. So I'm going to do the same same triangular shape again. This time I'm going to have. Um, could be four. So his ears would be here. His eyes would be here. And his cat nose is going to be here. Oh, I just realized I made his ears too pointy. So we'll just erase those out. His ears need to be not so pointy. Some of that right there. Right there, right there, right there. I think I like his nose as much as I do. Here we go. Let's switch pencils. We'll sharpen that one later. A little cut nose. Now we're talking. So, stripe here. Stripe here. Stripe here, stripe here, yeah. and then we'll put 
his tail right back here. Some stripes on his tail. I'm gonna draw a bunny. All right, now we're gonna draw him still rolling over on his back. I'm gonna draw him laying down. So I'm gonna draw that triangular shape like this. Same shape, all three ones, same shape, except here, we're going to have his tail curled around this way, and a paw here, and another paw here, like that. Does it run to you? So the eye here. There we go. So I'm going to go in the edge of this details, fill it out a little bit more. Three, cats, three um, whatever you want to call him. I think he's dim sum. He's a, or maybe a rice ball. I don't, I don't know what he is. He could be an orange. So, um, so that's it for today. That's all I have. Um, if you have any questions, or would like to post some of your drawings in the comments below, I would love to see them. Draw one more right here. There we go. <laughs> Let's check in on Betsy and see what she's drawing. She's got a rabbit and a carrot, and it looks. Otherwise, it's pretty amazing. Well, I hope you guys have enjoyed today's lesson. We'll see you next time. We're going to go outside and do some landscape drawing. So, see you next time. Take care. Bye-bye.